There's an innovative contribution to the African American community in the early 20th century about the history of African Americans in business that contributed to the growth of Houston as seen here in the 1920s. At the height of business development for African Americans, women were the first to take charge. Nubia Franklin, the owner of A. Franklin Beauty School, was the first successful black business owner in the cosmetology and the beauty supply field. There were other prominent African American businesses such as restaurants, grocery stores, a ballroom, movie theaters, and office buildings where many African American professional offices were located. Hobart Taylor was a successful businessman during the twentieth century as well as the first black millionaire in the state of Texas. He also founded Houston's Negro Chamber of Commerce in the 1930s. The Chamber of Commerce hoped to encourage the increase of black business and increase the support for African American business. Houston has a long history of successful African American businesses and business people who not only contributed to Houston's black community, but the city of Houston itself.